And how beautiful is that sky here in Auckland? And that's John Boy Marva lining up at the back. Jamal Kasakow, Chance Bunt, Aaron White, Hane King. In the halves, it's going to be Joe McCartney, Hugh Snow. And up the front, the big boys. John Nanai, Jaden White, Taranga Alfeu. And looking up the edges, it's going to be Kobe Johnston, Sione Matos, and David Tiawa on the bench here for the Northern Weta. Thomas Wallace, David Barner, Sabbath Tua. And to conclude your 17, Jerome Daly. And open it up with the Orcas. At home, Bunty Campolo, Tyler Alamatangi, Tatera Maxwell, Cooper Gronk, Rakamanu. And up in the halves, it's Matthew Vaughan. And the Raider, Luke Thompson. Big boys up front, Samuel Lillard, Damian Moana. And what might some might say the biggest prop in the comp, space to pace. Logan Guys, Chris Lord as your captain, Cameron Hodson. And on the bench, Mason Remy, Lecky Tua. Logan Strange and Johnny Columbus. And a few matchups here for you this evening. Head to head game two. The way to lead 1 0 at Forces Spa Stadium. Apologies for the pronunciation, but dynamic backline for the Orcas. Experienced squad. And they got the home field advantage here this evening. Chris Law to Terra Maxwell. Space to pace to look out for. Strengths here for the Wetter. They've got a very tough forward pack. Explosive counter attacks and solid defense. Bunt, McCartney, Nanai. We'll see you all very shortly, just after this quick break. Here it is, ladies and gentlemen. Your second game of the Aotearoa State of Origin series. McCartney there leading out his wetter side. Kobe Johnston, the second row. Matt Urs, and there's Wallace being moved to the bench here for the second game. Trying to mix it up. There's Chris Lord with his Orcas. What a game we're in for. The passion, the rivalry. It's all going to be alive here. At home here in New Zealand this evening. Eddie Oliver, as always, will be up in the box. Taking along for this amazing ride that I hope both of these sides are going to take us on. And there's Sunny Visuals always doing all of the promotion work, all of the visuals. Everything that you see on the screen is all of the benefit of Sunny Tire. And a massive um, shout out to him for allowing me to do the comms for this game here this evening. I'm very proud and honored to be put into this position. And I'm very excited to be watching these players paying for the ticket to get over to NZ to watch it live. Vaughn will get us underway. The first 40 minutes are about to unfold in front of you. There's Nanai for the big return. The big boys. What a contest. It's going to be up the middle. Space the pace. Nanai. Columbus. Oh, Johnston. The, the amount of platinum props are that are going to be in this contest are absolutely out of this earth. And Snow now will go inside to Matarus. Just on the outside the 20, they'll go take it off left here. John Boy Maava. Short line break there, getting them 10 meters. Good post contact meters. Now yeah, they'll bring it back right now. Early kick here from Madero Stanfield. And I like this change up here from the Orcas to Terra Maxwell to fullback. Spoken about in podcast earlier last week in the SRL. It's good to see a bit more flair back there. Alamatangi, who has been put out into the centers. Looking to spice it up because if this is if this uh, if there's a loss coming for the Orcas here, Matos intercept, and now the first chance here in good field position. It's going to be the wetter side. They'll take it inside now to Bunce. A oh, hard chance, Bunce. Alamatungi, I should say Maxwell not having to get his hands dirty there. Short side now, McCartney. He'll hold on to it. That's third tackle now here for the Northern Wetter. Now send it back left. That's David Tiawa. He does that for the second row of the Storm. Now he's doing it here for the Northern Wetter. And why not? You got McCartney and Snow there. They're going to set you up every day of the week. Moana infield. Too busy ball watching there to Terra Maxwell as well. And the Northern Wetter, they get their first points here this afternoon.
And Hugh Snow now to line up the kick. Straight over the black dot. Green lights here from the ref. Touch his flags are in the air. Six points to nil. Three minutes gone. Northern way to strike first. I'm sure there's been a lot in the off week about the Orcas trying to figure out what is the best side to combat the amount of class and talent that this wetter side has put together for this season the st of the Aotearoa State of Origin series. Game two it is. Everything's on the line here. The Orcas, they're going to be expected to throw it all at them. And now uh, it's going to be handed off to Nanai. Big men in the middle. Sort of been taken off the contest already. Taranga Alfeu. It's just been the backs and the second rowers that have taken taken all the highlight at the moment. Chance bounced straight through. He'll be pulled down on short of the halfway there. And Jaden White, he'll send it off left now. Taranga Alfeu straight through a hole. Cover's coming. He's coming up to the 20. Oh, Taranga Alfeu stopped doing it to them. Left hand to the upright now. Five minutes gone. It's fourth. Slow play the ball. They'll go right. It's going to go out the back to Chance Bunce. They've just moted up field now here, the wetter side. Are they able to convert on it to find more points? It's going to go McCartney. He'll settle it in front of the sticks here. The Orcas, they're going to catch a break, but you need to watch out of this defense here. The Northern wetter, they could absolutely smash you here coming off of your own line. He's going to have a big game there, space the pace. And Moana will send it off left here. Logan, guys, that's a good run there from the veteran. Straight through. Who found himself at the Storm in Season 7. Just short of the 40 there. Now we're going to go right. It's going to go out the back. To Terra Maxwell. Linking up with Vaughn. Do you like that combination? The Bulldogs combination. Watch out. They're going left now. <laughs> Taken here by Maxwell. He'll go off it. Aaron White. Oh, he's going to burn them off the intercept. Just outside of the 10. That's going to be. That's first. Where well, they're going to go take it left. That's going to be John Nanai for another run. Right hand, the upright, the big man will be brought down, but they're in good position. Short side, I didn't see this coming. Nor did the Orcas. Aaron White, he got them the ball, and he would get the pleasure of finishing them off. Out wide it was, McCartney, beautiful ball. You talk about combinations. This has got Warriors style of play all over it. The halves, the outside backs, the hooker, the, well, the fullback. It's all there, and oh, they're just taking us on a ride now here, the Northern Wetter. Roller coaster of emotions, the past, the fear of the future here for both sides is all going to be in play. Who is going to win the second game of the ATRL State of Origin series? Because honestly, this game does determine who's going to win or who's going to keep it alive for a game three. And honestly, I'm going for the big game three, the all or nothing. Even though the Orcas are a bit behind at the moment with eight minutes gone, there's still plenty of time. I'm still going to be backing them. To get ahead. They've done so many changes to their side. I'm sure Chris Lord, Moana, Space the Pace, the Terra Maxwell, the class there. Surely that's enough. John Nanai now. Winding it up from the back fence. Just on the 25. Ref saying tackle one now. They'll go right. Chance bunts early ball. He's been so good early bunts. Hands all over everything. Line breaks. Defensively on point. Now McCartney. We brought down just on the 35. Now they'll send it off left here to David Tiawa. The opening try score of the game it was. Short of the halfway now. They're going to send it off left here now. Taranga out. Fehu had an amazing run earlier. 38 gained. A better defensive set now here from the Orcas. They'll be looking for a kick here. The Northern Wetter. And McCartney drives it downfield. That's going to be Bunty Cambolo for the return, and look at the tackle. Putting his body, his heritage, his pride on the line. And now they'll send it off here to Samuel Lillard. Lillard there, just over the 20. These big boys, they've got to stand up now. Guys, off here to space the pace. Matos in the middle. He's going to have to handle a lot of tackles early in the game here, I'm sure. Chris Lord, offload. Pig shot, Moana. He wore one. 
But he'll get up and play the ball. Nothing going wrong there for the number nine. Early kick here, though. That's going to be from Vaughn. Oh, it's a beautiful kick. Matthew Vaughn trying to turn the tide of the game. Oh, no. Oh, Chance Bunt stays in. He's a miracle worker. He does things no other human think that they could do. Hone King now. Around one. To Terry Maxwell, where are you? Halfway. Hone King still going. 40. He'll get pulled down with an ankle tap. They're looking to spread the ball very early here in the Orcas half. Right, they'll go. Short here. Terangra Fetu. Space the pace there to cover. Short side play looming here now. Dummy half white. He'll go that exact way. Out here to John Boy Maiava. Driven back there. Strong defense. Gronk in the tackle. Now they'll go right. Out the back. John Nanai won't go far there. But he sets him up beautifully in the middle of the field. For a crossfield bomb. Oh no, Ricochet picked up by Space of Pace. That's probably the first bit of miscommunication they've had all evening so far. 13 minutes gone. Chris Lord now. He's going to take advantage of the wayward defensive line that the Wetters presented to the Orcas. And now they'll send it off left. Looking for the switch play. Inside. Intercept picked up now. Matt Ulse will go for a run. Now play the advantage here, the Northern Wetter. Looking to just run it straight up the guts. Through the middle by John Nanai. And now they're just inside the 40. Right, they'll go. Matos. What a contest it's been so far. 10 points to nil in favor of the Northern Wetter. Third they'll be. Getting out quick there it was. The Orcas straight through. Matos, look at the speed on show. Oh! The ref's going to point to the spot. Matos playing it lock. He's got the ball playing. He's got the running ability. A bit of luck there. If they did get the ball back and tackled, they would have had to endure another six tackles there, the Orcas. But they're going to be over, and it's the big man and John Nanoi. John Nanoi, my apologies there. <laughs> And probably his easiest ta task of the game so far, Hugh Snow. He'll drive that one over the black dot as usual. 16 points, 2-0. 15 minutes gone here in the first half. And Matthew Vaughan with the ball. He'll put it on the tee. The Orcas still seeming to warm up to this contest so far. Trying to loosen up to Terry Maxwell. Having his left arm bandage up there pretty tight. I don't know if that's any concern or it's just for show. But now they'll go for it to ring around. Fetu. Beautiful return there from the big man. Five short of the 30. Left they'll go here to John Nanai. Offload. The big boy's now having an effect. That's second tackle. Now they'll go off left. That's going to be Kobe Johnston. Good post-contact meters there. Ref calling held. Right, they'll go now. Hugh Snow out the back here to Nanai. That's fourth now. Right, they're going to go the same way. Shifting it to the middle. Oh, that's a big shot. But McCartney will make them pay for taking the risk running out of the, running out of the line. Good field position now for an attacking kick. Matt Orsi tried doing it again. It won't work the second time. The Orca's ready for it that time. And a short ball now here to Logan, guys. Got a good line break early, I'm sure. He'll be looking for more of those as the game unfolds. Now they'll go off right. Inside to Terra Maxwell. Here he goes, having his mark offloading to Hodson. Cameron Hodson there with the ball, just short of the halfway. Marcus getting on side, plays as well. Left they'll go, short side play. Here goes Tyler Alamatungi. Looking a lot better this week out there in the centers. I'm sure they'll be happy with that change. Lord, ball playing in outer space to pace. He's just a monster that towers above the rest. And a penalty in front of the sticks. About 23 meters out. Chris Lord, the captain, he'll get his little kicker over Matthew Vaughan. To slot it over for two points.
Looking for the left to right hand curve, and that's what he'll get. First points here for the Orcas. It's going to be off a penalty goal. 16 points to two. A lot of a lot of things happening already in the first 20 minute stanza. Northern Weta just coming out and absolutely demolishing whatever the Orcas had in plan. They're going to have to play catch-up footy from now on, I'm pretty sure. Lillard, oh, he'll wind it up there, the big man. Just inside of the 20, the former Raider, now Bulldog. Now they'll go right. It's going to be Logan, guys. Strong tackle. Just outside the 20, now interchanges occurring in the background. Oh, no, Ricochet picked up David Tiawa. Six tackles. And the ref's not going to call the advantage here. We brought up for a scrum. Again, probably that is a glitch that sometimes does occur in the game. But they'll play on with it. Left out go. Chance bunts. Strong tackle made there. Six tackles they've got to hold out for here now, the Orcas. Right, they'll go. Jane White out of dummy half. And a penalty given away. Oh, that's pretty smart there from the Orcas. Just trying to contain their line. It was disorganized. Right, they'll go now. That's going to be David Barnard. But this is just more pain and more defense they have to endure. Will it fatigue them coming into the later stages of the game? What a ball. David Tiawa. They'll get around the legs. But that is just showing the combinations in full effect there. McCartney to, t to Tiawa. Moana had having to get around the legs there. But it's going to come back as a red light. For the wetter side, the ref will take them back to the 10 meter line for some more tackles to be played out. Left out, go. Out the back, it'll go. And that's going to be Hugh Snow driving at 101. Pull down short. That's only third. Watch out here. Watch out, Matos. See only Matos. One on one. See you later. Underneath the sticks. He got a try assist earlier. Now he's going to get one for himself. It's going to go up as no try from the ref. I don't know what he's looking at. He's not even, he's too busy looking at the camera. Reminds me of a referee called Television Tony. Might have him here in the stadium. I've got no clue. But that's green lights here for them. And the Northern Weta. That is a standout performance that they've put in so far. 20 points. Neil, they pretty much will be keeping pace with the clock at the moment. But this is a, you know, an opening I'm sure none of us did expect. They've gone in pretty much unchanged. 22 points to 2. They're 6 points away from the score that they finished with in game 1. Anything could happen here. I've got no clue. The Orcas, they've got a lot to do. They have to hold out for half time. 18 minutes to hold out for. They've got to get a try or two until then if they want to be in the contest for the second half. And Vaughan will put the ball on the tee to get us back underway. Driving it downfield. Taken there by John McCartney. Thomas Wallace, who's moved to prop here by the looks of it, coming off of the bench. That's why Mato Us is starting at the 13. He's not one to break tackles, but if you give him a line break, he's got an excellent running game by the looks of it. Chance Bunce now. Around one. Bunce. The foot race with Tatara Maxwell. See you later. The veteran fullback's going to show Maxwell how it's done. He'll throw the ball in the air. He'll come falling down and so are the points with him. And look at the amount of wires around him there. White, snow. And then the little man in Sione Matos. That was a beautiful run there from Chance Bunce. Just outpacing, outclassing. Too much determination, too much effort as a valiant chase. In the end, it's not enough for chance bunts. And the old stallion getting over the line there for the Northern Wetter. Hugh Snow converts 28 points to 24 ahead of the clock now.
And that's the scoring that they did finish with at the end of game one here, the Northern Weta. And we've still got <laughs> 16 minutes to go here in this first half. A lot of footy to still be played, of course. Matthew Vaughan now. Hugh Snow will hand it off here to Thomas Wallace. Hooker primary playing at the props now. He's been everywhere. The halves. Hooker. Lock and now in the props. David Tiawa. Beautiful run. Maxwell going to have to get back there for the tackle. Just over the halfway. Right, they'll send it. Off here to Hone King now. Round one. It's going to be third tackle. 35 out now here from the Orcas line. Beautiful ball out here to David Barner. Won't go anywhere though. 30 out. Left, they're going to send it. It's going to be Matos. Straight through a hole. He's already gotten one. The beautiful pass. John Boy Maiava won't do anything with it. Should have kept pressing for the corner, but it's fifth nonetheless. Cows to cow in the pocket. He'll go. Snow, the bomb up. On point. Bunts underneath it. Oh, chance, Bunts. You are too classy, my friend. Pretty confident it was, Bunts. My poly... I'm not 100% sure who's gotten that there. The replay... Was it tapped back or knocked on? That's going to be within conversation, I'm sure. But it's going to be green lights. It's obstructed. My view is obstructed by the goalpost there. I'm sure there's going to be plenty of conversation of that in SRL chat as the replays and the conversion is going to be undertaken here by Hugh Snow. But I'm not sure if if Chance Bunce did touch that. It did look like it did have forward motion, but we'll save the controversy for the off week. The Orcas, they got a contest here and a big mountain to climb. That's going to be Vaughn now in the halfway. Very familiar territory for him. Chris Lord pointing out to where they want to get the team around the park. They've got to get to their points to execute some plays, to get some points on the board. <clears throat> and now just inside of the 10. I'll be handed off to Wallace. Former teammates colliding there. Wallace and Lord. Short ball in out to Tiawa. How good's he been? Just his line breaks, the speed that he's got. Matos at lock has been a remarkable change here for the Northern Wetter side. Whoever cooked that up, brilliant idea and congratulations to you. I put my hat off to that. Short side now. Backdoor plays. It will be. Bunce looked to go himself. Did have an unmarked John Boy Maiava, but didn't use him on that occasion. Out the back now. Matos, there he is again. He's a live wire at lock, short of the halfway now. It's going to be sent in the pocket for a fifth tackle kick from Snow. Drives it downfield beautifully. Bunty Cambolo for the return. Cambolo Bunce is there to cover as always. Just over the halfway, that's going to be now. Off hit a Chris Lord. Three in the tackle to bring him down, and that's what you need, the minimum. Right, that's going to be. Short ball to Vaughan. Off here to Cameron Hodson. That's 30 now. Third tackle it will be. Short side play. Can they find some points? Down the sideline. Raikamanu. Such a good fullback is at the Roosters. Out on the wing at the moment. That's fourth. Left, they're going to take it. Moana here off the tour. And he'll be brought down just on that 10 meter line. They're looking for a point off the kick here. Will be Vaughan with the bomb. That's beautiful. It's a bit too deep, is it? Yeah, it is. Nobody was able to contest it. Hone King takes it with ease. Out to the 20 meter line. It will be now here for the Northern Wetter. And Matos on the 25. Send it off right here. Thomas Wallace. Oh, bumping off one now, Wallace. That's going to be on the halfway now. Left. White will send it. Hugh Snow. That's going to be Kobe Johnston, who'll play the ball there now. White will send it off left. Here's Chance Bunce he's leaking up with. They finally make a completed tackle on him. That's third tackle now. A few more here to indulge the Orcas. Inside, Kobe Johnston. Beautiful ball playing here at the moment. Just outside of the northern way to 30. Out the back, they'll go here to Barna. 
And that's fifth tackle now here for the Northern Weather. The Orcas, they're going to need a kick return of a lifetime here. They need to find a try. Hugh Snow with it. Down here to the man, Punty Campolo. Foot race now. Bunce, yeah, too much of a head start against him. Read it well. Covered back perfectly. Now they send it off right. Deterra Maxwell with the ball. Around one. Here's a foot race to the ages. Bunce beat him earlier. He'll offload. Taken by Hodson. Called by the referee. It didn't touch. And all the way to play. To Tara Maxwell again. Around one. Tried his arm once. He'll try it again and he'll drive and he'll drive. Over the line he'll go. And here come the points for the Orcas. Bunce is an amazing man. He can't be in. He can't be everywhere at once. That was the second or third time that he had to cover up a line break. I don't blame him. They're on the back foot for that whole set there. And that's the first time all evening. That's what you got to do. Quick play the balls. Get your speed man onto it. The Orcas, they finally find some much needed point here late in the first half. And they need to take this momentum to the second. A big kick here, kick here from Vaughan. It might be easy. You don't want to overthink it. You just got to get the points on the board. Beautifully struck there. Green lights, flags in the air. 34 points to 8. It's still a big margin. And they know that the Orcas have got a big mountain to climb late in the first and throughout the whole of the second half. I don't think anybody was expecting this performance in the first half from the Weta side. I certainly wasn't myself. The Northern Weta. They're just showing the class, the combinations... The glue that they've got within this side and the resilience for each other and the trust of knowing where to be at the right time it, and the execution is absolutely first class for the second installment, the second game of the RTR State of Origin se Series in the mid-season break of the SRL. Logan Guys now drive it up just on the 35. That's third tackle. Moana send it off right, spreading it here, short ball to Chris Lord. He's just been holding down this middle defense. Left, they'll go now, spreading it off here to Thompson. Well handled, strong tackle. It's going to be short of the halfway now. That'll be fifth. They'll be looking to kick out of trouble through Vaughan. Beautiful strike of the ball. Crossed body kick it was. Hone King now for the return. Hone King. Oh, beautiful kick return there. Well handled. It's Terra Maxwell there. That's definitely an area where they've improved. He might have given away a try to bounce, but his defense has been on point. I, he should be proud of his performance. His team, you know, they're on the back foot. He's done everything he can. He's gotten them a try. Now it's up to the rest to follow the leader by the looks of it. Short side play lurking now. White to dummy half. He'll send it off that way. Wallace, long ball. John Boy Maava. That's going to be on the 10 there. Maava to play the ball. Send it back to the 20. White. Grab a kick. Oh, that is too good. A double for Matt Us. Sioni Matt Us, that's a double for you, my friend. Wallace getting up around him. This kick from Snow was absolutely legendary. Might have ricocheted. My apologies. It was from White. Was looking for buns, but it ricocheted off one. Picked up. Left hand the upright, and they're going to be looking for 40 points here in the first half. Definitely keeping pace with the clock, coming in to the break. And converted there from Hugh Snow. That's going to be 40 points to 8, 38 minutes gone. Beautiful performance both of these sides have put on in the first half for us. Absolutely loving every single minute of it. Going to be on the halfway mark here though. Matthew Vaughan to drive it downfield. A minute and a half to go in the first half. John Nanai fresh on the field. Props change for both sides I'm sure. 
But a lot of things to cook up for the Orcas, the captains and the coaches at halftime. They've got to come back. It's a win or die situation at the moment. 40 minutes to decide the series. Chance Bounce looking to make them pay late in the first half. Are they going to be looking for some more points here, the Northern Wetter? I'll send it out the back here to Joe McCartney. You can't find any space there, McCartney. But he'll be brought down just on the 25 out here from the Orcas line. Left out go. Turing around the field. Ball plate to Nanai. And that's going to be it for the first half on Israel TV. You'll see you shortly here for the second half. Welcome back here to the second half on SRL TV. And what a first half performance the Northern Wetter put up here against the Orcas. You talk about clashes. You talk about contests. This is not one of them, ladies and gentlemen. What a contest they did put in. Eddie Oliver, as always, bounce out there at fullback, ready to go for an amazing second half. 40 points to 8. It's unheard of, and I don't think nothing has been seen like it in the Atia Royal State of Origin series so far. Logan Strange on the field. These Fords are going to have to try and turn the tide for them at the moment. The Orcas, they absolutely had no go, no momentum in that first half. They did come away with the try. Let's see if they can find more here in the second. Cambolo, they'll go out wide early for the third tackle to, to arise. Not really going far there. 20 meter line, they'll send it off right. Logan, guys, he had some brilliant moments here in the first half. They're going to need a lot more of them from him. Short ball now, space the pace. He saw a bit of ball in the first half, but he didn't have one of his best performances. He's going to have to come out for them in the second. Thompson now will drive it downfield. That's over the 30. He'll land. John Boy Maiava, he'll spin back right back to him. Now it's with the foot race to Tara Maxwell. John Boy Maiava, here's the teammates running at each other. That'll be brought down on the 10. That's going to make it only first tackle. Short side play here. Wallace, he'll go there. At the hooker position to Aaron White. I don't know how well you can start a second half, but I think <laughs> the Northern Wetter, they've just shown you the blueprint. Get to work. Let's start the construction because they're trying to rebuild the first here, the Wetter. The Orcas, hands on heads. The amount of just class and, you know, the different amount of players that are able to play multiple positions here for the Wetter while I'm chewing and <laughs> slurring around on my own words. They've got so many players that can play in multiple positions. Hughes Snow to go convert. Wallace being one of them. Matt Ellis, they can play at lock. And they'll hit the steel work. Nonetheless, the fans are cool calm collected in their seats. So are the Northern Weather. They're on cruise control. And there's Vaughn now to drive it downfield. It's going to be just on the five. Here's Snow. Oh, long ball out now here to Teranga Alfeu. In front of the upright, it's going to land now. The right hand side, they'll go. McCartney inside. Bunce. Bunce around one. What a first half he had. And he's just going to get them out of their own end. Short of the halfway. Right, they'll go. McCartney. He'll just tuck the ball under and run there. It's going to make it third. Left, they'll go now. David Tiawa for a run. Just short of the 40. It will be there. Fourth tackle, it's going to be. Left, they'll send it. Off here down to Kobe Johnston. And Kobe Johnston brought down there. Just short of the Orcas 30. Kick now here from Snow. Not well struck. Vaughn will pick it up. And he left his ribs exposed for Maiava just to dig the shoulder into. Now it's going to be Rakamanu. A big hit there on him. He wore it well though. Left they're going to send it. Space to pace. He'll be pulled down on the halfway there. Right they're going to send it. Inside ball looking here for Tatera Maxwell. Won't go anywhere on that occasion. That's going to make it fourth tackle now here for them. Left they'll send it from Moana. Short ball here to Strange. Logan Strange will be brought down just outside of the 30 meter line. That's fifth tackle. Six minutes gone here in the second half. Crossfield punt across the body. Taken well here by Hone King. King now. He won't go far there. Well wrapped up in the wetter 20. 
Now they'll go off left. Tiawa, what a first half he had. Having his hands all over the ball. And now it's going to be off to Tarango Alfeu. Just inside of the 40 there. Working it up the middle now. Kobe Johnston will go for a run. Johnston there short of the halfway. Oh, bun straight through. That's going to be 37 gained in this set now here for the wetter. Sending it into the pocket for Makani to do the duties. Downfield, it's going to be taken by Riker Manu. Manu, around one. Bunt's coming. He's going to get there every day of the week. Maiava wasn't far behind. Covered up well just outside the 30, but a very well, much needed return. Space to pace now. Here we go. This is what we like to see. Look at the big man breaking tackles in open space. And that's going to be just on the 30. Sending it out wide. Johnny Columbus straight through a hole. Looking well so far here, Columbus. Now they send it off left. It's going to be Chris Lord ball playing it to Hodson. Uh, right hand the up right now. Sending it off left, Vaughn. Long ball picked up. David Tiawa. Look at the big man in full stride. Spoke about it earlier. He's got his hands all over the ball. He knows exactly where to be at the right time. McCartney for a run. That was a bit adventurous there from Vaughn. Just throwing the ball in hope. How merry type player was. Here goes Tower again. How good is he at this 12th position? That's going to be third. Looking to wind it up through the middle. It's going to be Tarango Alfeu. Oh, big bump off. Get out of my way. Space to pace, says Feu. And now they're going to send it off right. Underneath it's going to be here to Chance Bunce. Out the back, McCartney. McCartney be brought down. Meter short of the line. That's going to make a fifth tackle. 29 minutes to go. Daly. Daly. Oh! Off the legs. Picked up by Wallace, I believe. And the cameraman doesn't need any approv approval from the referee. We'll have a look at the replay here. Taken by Daly out of position. Going for the grubber kick. Ricocheted off. Some awkward defenders there. We'll get another look at it. Yeah, it, so it did hit the boot. It wasn't a knock-on. Called play on by the ref. Fair play by the looks of that. You'll take one last look at the put-down and then blow the whistle f for the try, but not what the Orcas have wanted. The weather getting first points of the second half. And straight over the sticks, they'll go. 50 points to 8. I, I'm i just going to leave this first. I'll try to put words to it because I've got none. Um, wow. That is an abs that's an outstanding performance. we still got 30 minutes of footy to play. I'm not going to write the Orcas off yet. There's a lot of time, but 50 points and a half. You know, in 42, give or take. But Vaughn to kick off. That is, that is astonishing. Front of the sticks, Bunts. He'll hand it off here to, to Taranga Alfeu. He's always good at just getting around that first defender and dragging them along with him for an extra few meters, isn't he, Feu? It's going to be Johnston. And then they'll go right. There's the unfamiliar sponsor on the ground there. Delay Daly now. I nearly said Delaney. That's going to be Daly. That's third. Left, we're going to take it. It's going to be Johnston. And Kobe will drive it up over the halfway for his team. Roaring now, the wetter side. Left, they're going to go. David Barner in the centers. I believe that's replacing Jamal Kasakow. That's going to be fifth tackle. We didn't see much of Kasakow in that first half. Hopefully he comes out in the second, or he's still out there on the field. Hugh Snow, not the best of kicks. Taken by Maxwell now. Maxwell, bunts. The fullbacks will collide just short of the halfway. Moana will send it off left to a flat-footed Vaughan. And it'll be pulled down exactly where the first tackle did occur. Left, they'll go now. This is better play. Off here to Logan, guys. Looking to bring it back the other way now. Moana. Short ball here. Space to pace. Well handled. He's been contained all night. Besides that one run that he did early in the second half. Left, they're going to go. Lord. Off here. It worked. Didn't work the first time. But try, try again. You'll succeed. Guys, straight through. That's going to be left hand to the upright now. In the ball pocket, it's going to be Thompson. 
Crossfield bomb on point well. Who's underneath it? Tap back to Terra Maxwell. He'll drive for the line, but there's too many defenders. The scramble is immaculate. By the Northern Wetter, had to be done. And they put their hands up, and that's a shot and a half. Hone will wear it well. To Taranga Al Fetu, looking to return serve there. It's going to be second on the 20. Left, they're going to take it now. Off here to Justice Daly. Oh, Daly will go for a run. Daly's just going to drive up the field there. Excellent stuff there from him. They'll go right now. Oh, knock on called by the referee. And that is Jerome Daly. My apologies, not Justice. On the halfway left, they'll go. Logan Strange. Oh, see you later, Fetu. How good Strange been back in the competition. It's amazing to see guys now for a run. Now they send it off right. Thompson, short ball, Hodson. That's third. Left hand, the upright's going to be. Right, they'll send it. It's going to be Chris Lord. Pull down exactly. Same line. Now they spread it off left. Logan, guys, look at the tackle. That was McCartney underneath. Beautifully well handled. Driven back. Fifth tackle it is now. Thompson, the bomb. It's a bit short of the goal line. Taken well by Bunce. And he'll stay in the field of play. They had the right idea there, Thompson. If he just put the kick in a bit deeper, would have allowed for... Bunce to be driven back into the end goal, but he was too far out, had plenty of room to work with. Took the ball safely. Now McCartney straight through a hole. And he'll just put his body right in front of Maxwell, who will collide there. Now that's third. Looking to just wind it up the guts here will be Feu. Feu, well handled there by the Orcas defense. That's fourth. Looking to shift it off left. Kobe Johnston for the run. He'll settle the set here for them. Just a 45 out here from the Orcas line. The kick from Snow is called for. Ricocheted. Taken into touch. Did Columbus touch the ball before it went over the line? Was his feet over the line when he touched it first? If not, he might have jumped from... He might have jumped from the field of play. Which he has done. That's going to be the ball here from... To the Weta. That's unfortunate there from the Orcas. Johnston will take the first ball to set. Just not much sideline awareness there from Columbus. And Hugh Snow, oh, that pass. That was a bit dramatic and a bit adventurous, but Strange will pick it up. I'm sure he wasn't ready for it, but the veterans still got <laughs> the brilliant motor skills there to pick up the ball. Now that second tackle, right, they'll go. Short ball here from Thompson to Lord. That's going to make it 30. Looking for the switch play, I think. Maxwell back deep. Right, though. Inside, Vaughn wasn't able to pick it up. That's going to make it just outside of 30 now here for the Orcas. They'll send it off here to Logan, guys. He's always in amazing form for whatever team he does play with. That's going to make it fifth, though, nonetheless. Pocket, it's going to take it. Thompson, Thompson. He's just going to hold on to it, be brought down on the 20. McCartney in there. They read it beautifully there, the Northern Wetter. And they'll have the ball straight back. And that's going to bring it up onto the 30. McCartney short ball there to John Nanai, who's back on the field here. Short of the 40. Interchanges occurring for the Northern Wetter and also the Orcas. That's just going to be brought down on the halfway now. Tiawa playing the ball. Left, they'll send it. Spreading it out. The halves linking. There's Hugh Snow on point. Just on the 40 now. Right, they'll go. McCartney off here to Aaron White. Around one. Who's the only try scorer in the second half so far. It's going to be fifth tackle now here for the Northern Wetter. There's too much damage done in the first for the Orcas to return. Hone King now with the ball. Rakamani, my apologies. But again, look at this defense. It's going to be John Boy Marva. He's been on point all evening. Out there with David Bardner assisting him as well. And just inside of the 20, the Orcas will play the ball last second. Short ball. Look at this defense. Samuel Lillard going absolutely nowhere. Inside of the 30 now. Left they'll go. It's going to be Logan Guys. 
Not getting an inch here. That's four tackle. I wouldn't be surprised if they go for the early kick. Thompson, he thought about it, but he'll just take the run to finish off the set. So who's going to come around to the kick? Is Vaughn going to have to run all the way over? No, they're going to give it off to Lord. We all know he loves his kicking. And now it's going to be taken by Hone King. What's he got for us, Hone? Around one, King. King will be brought down just over the 40. Good return. That's first now here for the wetter. I send it down the short side of McCartney. And now left they'll go. And that's going to be Jerome Daly. Here's Castle Cow back on the field. It's going to be fourth. I send it off. Wallace nowhere there. It was in probably three or four different minds. Decided to take the fourth option. That's standing still and taking the tackle. Castle Cow to conclude the set on the 30. Exactly now. That's fifth tackle. 43 meters, meters gained for them. That's going to be McCartney driving it inside of the 10. Bunty Cambolo for the return. Cambolo. Such a good winger for the Cowboys. He's been quiet in places during this game. He's had his good moments, though. Out the back now, Samuel Lillard. Well handled. Look at Wallace in there. He's not afraid of the big boys there. Thomas Wallace. Now they're going to send it off left. Short ball leader, guys. Logan Guys driving to the 35. Now they've got a short side play. Alamatungi. He'll send it straight. Oh, the intercept. Hone King. Oh, that is beautifully red. He wasn't able to break free of the tackle, but he'll get the weight of the ball back in probably the best field position that they've had since the start of the second half. Full tackle sets up their sleeve now. Short ball here to Nanai. Trying to hold up the defensive line, try and find a hole there. Snow for Nanai. Didn't work there. Inside, though. Bunts around one. They're coming to cover second tackle. Space the pace in there with it. Short side raid now coming. White off here. Hone King. Is he going to get a try? The vice captain. No, he won't. If he brought down five meters short. Fifth tackle. 12 minutes to go now in the second half. Boom. It's too deep. Take him well back to Terra Maxwell. They'll tackle him all you want. 20 meter tap up and coming here for the Orcas. And there's Gronk now. My apologies there for the voice crack. And that's going to be Lillard. I do like the move. Gronk on in the forwards. Lillard there to join him. Now they send it off left here to Logan, guys. He's going to make it second tackle. Left they'll go. At the back. Maxwell. Off here to Bunty Cambolo. And Cambolo will be brought down on the halfway. Right they'll send it. Space the pace. Lillard now will be. Samuel Lillard. Take it off right now. Guys. Guys driving. He'll be pulled down just very short of the 30. That's fifth tackle. Coming up to the final 10 minutes now. The second game of the Atiro State of Origin Series. John Boy Maiava. Northern Wetter looking to take it all the way. First two game win it will be. Chance Bunce. I'm not sure how many people expected this. Look at Bunce go. Maxwell is in another foot race. Can he get him this time? Oh, what a ball. Aaron White. See you later, Orcas. Oh, no. Oh, you can't write the script. Nobody would have expected that. That would have been the try of the series. But he was pulled down short there. Guys now for the ball. It's going to be just outside of the 20. Why? He could have been over for, a for, I think, a hat-trick. It could have been. On the 30, though, that's third. Ten minutes to go. Right, they'll send it. Vaughn at the back here to space the pace. That's going to be on the 40. Fourth tackle. Early kick now. Calls from Vaughn. Did he keep his foot inside the 40? It's looking to be a 40-20. What's the ref going to call it? Oh, Bunce will do it for him. And that's probably the first error of the night, or probably the series there from Chance Bunce. Just is carrying a bit too much pace, trying to come up to that ball. The kick chase, that's all it was. And his foot was inside. That would have been a 40-20, I'm pretty confident. Beautiful kick there from Vaughn. And here we go, the Orcas. An opportunity to find their first points of the second half. Space to pace will start off the set. Moana will send it up the middle again to Gronk. And Cooper Gronk will be brought down just in front of the sticks. Left they'll go. Long ball to Guys. Logan Guys driving. 
Can he find a try? He deserves it. Yes, he will. Logan Guy is there. He'll get the first try of the second half here for the Orcas. Much needed try it was. One on one. You're not going to stop a more determined man. He's played his skin out here, guys, this evening. I think that was Tiawa in there with the tackle. Just not strong enough. Kasakau not coming along to support. But I'll be green lights here and a kick to come for Luke Thompson. My apologies, Matthew Vaughan, not Luke Thompson. But Vaughan here to come convert. Bit of an acute angle it will be. But I'm sure it's not going to scare him. Any points that they get here is just going to be consolation from now and end here for the Orcas just to help this uh, points differential, which is absolutely humongous from the Northern Weather. And here we go, on the halfway it's going to be. And eight minutes to go now, will be for the second half. Still plenty of time for both teams to find some points. We'll see who will take it into two hands now. Kicked off there by Snow, taken by Vaughn, off here to Cooper Gronk. And Gronk, he'll drive up onto the 20, that's three in the tackle to bring him down. Mark is getting on side. Moana, he'll send it off left. Short ball there to Guy. Straight through. Look how good he's been. Where's the offload? There it is. On point to Lillard. Now they'll send it off left. Short side play to Terra Maxwell. Oh, no. Miscommunication. Thompson, Maxwell. They're looking for each other, but in the end, it just found the white chalk. And Hone, I'm pretty sure he's excited. To see that one go through, because I'm sure Totoro Maxwell was nearly in full flight, about to step around the line. Jaden White will take up a run. This has been a beautiful contest. Left now, McCartney. Long ball. Out here to Hugh Snow now. And the short side's looking to lurk, and that's where they're going to go. Johnston. Beautiful ball. Jumbo Maiva. We brought 15 out of. The Orca's line. Right, they'll go. Beautiful ball out the back to White. He won't go anywhere on this occasion. Thomas Wallace in there at dummy half there now. No. Now they'll go left. The place that they came from, they're going to go back to. That's going to be 34 gained in this set. Now here for the wetter. Is it going to be off of a kick? It might be. Here's Barter. It's going to ricochet. He'll put one in. It's going to be offside. <laughs> that was absolutely all over the place there from, from the wetter. Northern Weta just losing their compass a tiny bit there, but I'm sure they'll get it back on the track for the final five-minute stanza here. Moana, he'll kick for touch. They'll send it off left now. Space to pace. It's minutes now. Left they'll go. Vaughn out the back here to Lillard. And that's going to make it second. Right they'll go. Moana off to Vaughn. Off here to Terra Maxwell now. Finding some space. A good run there from him. Just inside of the 40 now. Left they'll go. Cameron Hodgson straight through. Beautiful run. Bounce back there to cover up. But he's looking tired. Didn't have, didn't have wheels there to just carry on with it. Left they'll go. Here's guys again. And Tiao will bring him down left hand. The upright. This will bring up fifth tackle. Grab a kick lurking. Thompson picked up by Jaden White. The big man spaced the pace. Dove at thin air there. Got three minutes to go. Johnston now looking for a run. One, Kobe will get some post-contact meters. I'm looking forward to these stats at full time. Inside it go now to White. Jaden White straight through. Coming on at lock by the looks of that. Doing an amazing job. It's going to be second tackle. 40. Meter line. They'll go left here. Oh, there's John Boy Marva now. Straight through. Ankle tap needed to Terra Maxwell delivers. That's going to be third. Second now. They'll go right. Short ball here to Kobe Johnston. Space the pace will wrap him up. All ends up. It's going to be fourth. Looking to shift it off right. Watch out. Here comes Chance Bunce. Oh, Chance Bunce. Don't do it to them again. He's going to drive. Maxwell will pull him down. 69 meters gained. A minute to go here. Can they finish off the half with points? Big shot. Grab a kick. Picked up by Gronk. Oh, Cooper Gronk. Oh, what a way to finish the game. 
Bunce will dive at thin air. McCartney and Chase, it's in vain. They won't win near the Orcas, but Gronk's going to love that one, and I'm sure the home fans will as well. Flying Fox trying to get around the trying to get around the goalpost there to get a view of the referee. But if there's no better way to have a poor performance but finish off with a try like that. Full length of the field. Just give something the fans to cheer for at home in the stadium on TV. Matthew Vaughan to convert to make it 20 points to 50 points to 20. And I'm not 100% shot confident if we will get to kick off. I will have to check that. It's 10 seconds. We'll have to keep an eye on the in-game clock. And the clock is still running after the kick. The ref hasn't paused it. Play's still carrying on. We will line up, but that's going to be the siren. We will have a kickoff by the looks of it. One last play here, but they didn't take carry on within the second half here the wetter side but what is really good from them is their defense just held them to only two tries in that second half the orcas they've got a lot of work on to the for the third game but at the northern wetter have won the series two two games two zero that's full time congratulations here to the northern wetter joe mccartney Hone king I'm not sure who the other person is in the captaincy but an amazing job done chance bunter might put him in there but an amazing job. I'm sure they're going to be proud as we go over to look at the stats here. Gronk tries to Gronk, guys. Maxwell. And the list is just absolutely enormous. Three to Mataus. Two to White. One to Tiawa. Bunce one. Nanai Wallace. It's just the completion. 25. 71% to the Weta. 29 time possession to the Orcas. That is unheard of. 181 tackles to 148. 13 missed to 21 and 36 line breaks to 21. 28 missed tackles, by the way. That was, you know, Bunt's man, the match. We'll see why very shortly, I'm pretty sure. That is, that is huge. Vaughn there. Four conversions, seven to Snow. But it was 50 points to 20. That was the errors, six to nine. Very familiar to last game. As we go look at, have some individual stats here. Logan, guys... 14 tackles, 3 line breaks, 1 try. Player of the game here for the Orcas. Short just behind him to Terry Maxwell. He ran for 4. 14 tackles again. 26 tackles, 0 miss from Chris Lord. Played 66 minutes. He did an amazing job out there. Didn't do much in attack. Only ran for 80 meters. But his defense in the middle was outstanding. The tries came from out wide. Always just putting his heart, putting his pride on the line. A lot of players joining in with those tackles. Cameron Hodson and Space the Pace in there as well. And Damian Moana making 26 for himself. Missing three. One try assist. Gronk, that try at the end was absolutely amazing, wasn't it? Um, You know, just running the length of the field. I wouldn't be more proud of, to be a fan or to be a part of that. So Chris Lord, I'm sure he's proud of him. And as we go over here, look at the Northern Wetter. Chance Bunce. Oh, clocking 300. 10 line breaks, 1 try, 14 tackles. There's nothing better than it. 20 tackles here to, to Wallace, 1 missed. Jai McCartney, kicking meters, running meters, 197. 18 tackles, that is a very good performance from the half. 1 try assist to call to his name. But Jaden Wyatt, 4 try assists. That is absolutely outstanding, my friends. Had his hand imprinted all over the game. 2 tries to his other brother, <laughs> Aaron White. Kaustikow, quiet. Barna, Sabbath to Ua, very quiet. Didn't even touch the ball once in his 23 minutes. I'm sure they'll look to get him on the field a lot more there in the second, in the third game of this series. Aaron White there, two tries. Three tries to Siani Mataus. Thank you all very much for joining me. Eddie Oliver, as always, we'll see you for the third game on SRL TV.